Good evening and welcome to the Business Day. I'm Andrea Chisholm. Gas prices are going down tomorrow, but all other categories of fuel will increase. A litre of 87 and 90 gasoline will sell for $4.50 less. Diesel, ultra-low sulfur diesel and kerosene will however increase by $4.50. The fuel category has seen strong increases over the last few weeks, reflecting upward movements on the global finished products market. $2 will be added to propane, while butane will be sold for $1.50 more. Oil prices continue to fall today due to concerns that fuel demand could see further declines as a result of additional efforts to stop COVID-19 in China. Brent crude futures settled at $96.49, down $2.82 a barrel. U.S. West Texas Intermediate Crude ended down $2.09 to settle at $89.55 a barrel. The Jamaica Manufacturers and Exporters Association and its partners are equipping 20 local businesses with the knowledge base to list and sell on Amazon. The organization launched the Amazon project today. Javon Keys reports. August 2021 marked history for Jamaica and the e-commerce platform Amazon as the country was added to the list of states from which vendors were approved to sell. One year later, the Jamaica Manufacturers and Exporters Association, JMEA, has partnered with the Development Bank of Jamaica, DBJ, and Exim Bank Jamaica to launch the Amazon project. Executive Director of the JMEA, Kamisha Blake, says the initiative will start in September. Well, the cost of the project is $2.3 million. Jamaican dollars and over the next eight weeks we will be training 20 MSMEs in getting their products sold and on the Amazon platform. The key determining factor is having a product that we believe is ready for the international market so you know we have to look at you know your labeling um, the type of products that you have and to see Will this do well on Amazon? Kurt Dudney is a logistics consultant to Amazon who will be one of the facilitators on the project. He says it will take three key approaches. The eight weeks is going to include three main things. We have to get the information out there to get rid of all the speculation. We're going to tell you all the facts so that folks are really educated on what it's all about. Then. We teach you how to set up your store on Amazon, how to list your products, how to remain relevant, how to make sure that your listing is the top click. And then third of all, most importantly, we create that support, that after listing support that you maintain all the different changes. Amazon's very dynamic, so they change monthly, daily. I mean, it, it, down to the hour, there can be changes. So that support is, is what's going to be key to keep everybody successful. The JMEA says it hopes to scale the project going forward. The data from the first phase will help inform the approach to other iterations. For the Business Day, I'm Javon Keyes. Now to foreign currency trading. The U.S. dollar is being sold for an average $151.60. $117.46 is the going rate for the Canadian dollar and $176.27 for the pound. It's costing an average $152.72 for the euro. Enter the stock market now. The JSE index lost 475 points today, while the junior market index fell by two points. Leading advances include Paramount Trading Jamaica, Sibony Group, Cygnus Credit Investments US dollar shares, Jamaica Stock Exchange, and Blue Power Group. Decliners include Portland JSX, CAC 2000, Productive Business Solutions 9.75% Cumulative Redeemable Shares, MFS Capital Partners, and 138 Student Living Jamaica. And that's it for the Business Day. I'm Andrea Chisholm. Good evening.